on August 21, 2025, a significant seismic event shook the waters of the southernmost part of the world. A magnitude 7.5 earthquake struck the Drake Passage, a treacherous body of water that separates South America from Antarctica. Known for its turbulent seas and harsh weather, the Drake Passage is not typically associated with major earthquakes, making this event particularly noteworthy. The earthquake occurred at a relatively shallow depth of 11 kilometers, or about 7 miles below the ocean surface. Its epicenter was located approximately 700 kilometers, or 435 miles, southeast of Ushuaia, Argentina. Ushuaia, often referred to as the southernmost city in the world, is home to roughly 57,000 residents. Despite the distance, the tremors were felt by monitoring stations in the surrounding regions. Initially, the United States Geological Survey, or USGS, reported the earthquake as a magnitude 8.0 event. However, after further analysis, the magnitude was revised downward to 7.5. While still powerful, the revised figure is somewhat less severe than initially feared. Earthquakes of this magnitude release immense amounts of energy, capable of affecting the seafloor and potentially generating tsunamis. Following the earthquake, authorities acted swiftly to assess potential risks. Chile's Navy Hydrographic and Oceanographic Service issued a tsunami warning for its Antarctic territory. The area affected included the Base Free Site, located about 258 kilometers or 160 miles southeast of the quake's epicenter. This initial warning reflected the caution exercised by officials in regions vulnerable to ocean disturbances. However, after further analysis, the Pacific Tsunami Warning Center confirmed that there was no tsunami threat. Residents and scientific bases in the region were informed that the risk had been cleared, providing reassurance to those living and working in these remote areas. The lack of a tsunami is fortunate, as the combination of strong earthquake waves and unstable ocean conditions in the Drake Passage could have posed a serious danger. As of now, there have been no reports of significant damage or casualties linked to the earthquake. The remoteness of the epicenter, combined with the sparse population in the surrounding areas, has likely limited the impact on human settlements. Nonetheless, the quake serves as a reminder of the powerful natural forces present even in the most isolated corners of the planet. Seismologists and oceanographers are monitoring the region closely. The Drake Passage sits between major tectonic boundaries, making it an area of interest for studying geological activity. Earthquakes here, while less common than in regions like the Pacific Ring of Fire, can provide valuable insights into the dynamics of the Earth's crust and the interactions between tectonic plates. The timing of this earthquake also highlights the need for preparedness in remote and harsh environments. Antarctic research stations, ships navigating the southern oceans, and coastal communities in South America must all maintain robust emergency protocols to respond to natural events like this. Early warnings accurate magnitude assessments, and clear communication channels are critical in minimizing risks and ensuring safety. This earthquake in the Drake Passage joins a long history of notable seismic events around the world. Each event reminds us of the immense energy stored beneath the Earth's surface and the potential for sudden, dramatic change even in places far from densely populated areas. Scientists continue to study these events to better understand the processes at play and improve predictive models for future occurrences. In conclusion, the magnitude 7.5 earthquake in the Drake Passage on August 21, 2025, serves as a powerful reminder of the dynamic nature of our planet. While no tsunami or major damage has been reported, the event emphasizes the importance of monitoring, preparedness, and scientific research in remote regions. The Drake Passage, famous for its rough seas and critical location between continents, has now also become a point of interest for seismologists and those tracking the Earth's ever-changing activity. As we continue to observe and learn from such natural events, 
The goal remains clear. To deepen our understanding of the Earth, ensure the safety of communities, and appreciate the sheer scale of forces at work beneath the planet's surface.